Big story we're following. A man crosses a busy intersection, walks right into a restaurant completely naked. The man stays there in the buff for about eight minutes, completely shocking onlookers. This is video you see only right here on K2. Megan Kalkstein has the story, and Megan, pretty upsetting for the folks in the restaurant. Yeah, it really was, Stephen. One witness tells me that he wasn't quite sure what he was really seeing at first, but then he was surprised and even shocked to watch this guy sit down, walk around, even put a leg on the table right in front of other people. The man highlighted looks like any other customer in this restaurant, except the chairs are hiding one detail, something Aaron Winner caught on camera. Aaron says he noticed a man walking down the street. He says it was pretty clear the guy was making a beeline for Burgerville. He says he noticed something was a little bit off, so it wasn't until he did a double take that he realized what it was. I thought he was wearing shorts at first. So I was like, oh, well, man, that guy's just trucking it. It's 10 o'clock at night and <laughs> he's not wearing. And then I realized there was no shorts and there was nothing except a wristband and a folder. A source tells K2 the man is a mental health patient, but at the time only knowing that he was walking naked into a restaurant, Aaron Wenner grabbed his cell phone. For eight minutes on Sunday night, he captured the man's every move. Walking around naked, walking around the tables, walking up to the counter, walking around naked. He even caught the guy leg on the table with the other leg on the floor for kind of an open shot. Getting comfortable in front of others eating at the restaurant. You know, it's one thing to be sitting there naked and stuff, but to sit there with your leg up on the table right in front of the cash register is pretty disturbing. When deputies arrived, they talked to the man. Yeah, that's the only part I couldn't, I couldn't figure out why they had him bent over the table. Then led him outside. Full Monty out of the restaurant. Winner says as shocking as it was, he's glad there were no little kids around. If there would have been young kids in there, I think it probably would have been a whole whole different story, especially if there was parents mm -hmm. there with them. Now, we tried to talk to the people at the facility where our source says that this man is a patient. We are still waiting for word back on them, though federal privacy laws may make it difficult to get any kind of information. We do know that he wasn't arrested, even charged, but he was taken to a hospital for a mental uh, evaluation. So, kind of a sad story. Yeah, you bet it is. And just imagine how bizarre it would be if you were in that restaurant for eight minutes eight while he sat in there. Yep. Wow, what a story. Megan, thank you.